Oh, snap. What's that you got on? Yo, these are new r ones by Randy. I'm in the future with this. I'm stepping on top of the world. These are the new R. Ones by Rampage. Order right now. Land to land, C to C, state to state. These are official. Don't wait. The R. Ones by Rampage. Rated R Empire. Hey, go into the description box right now and get your Rated R Empire sneakers right now. And when you cop your pair, let them know that Sandman and Old Guy from the Hip Hop Uncensored podcast sent you. All right, NBA young boy, I don't talk about him much, right? But undoubtedly, he's one of the most successful young artists probably ever. I mean, you know, breaking all types of charts. You know, um, the, the youngsters love him. They, 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 they love him probably more than any artist out now. Maybe, you know, Drake might be edging him out. Maybe not even that, right? He's the, one of the biggest artists out right now. But he put out a video earlier, right? I want to play. Then I want to kind of give a little bit of constructive criticism to what he said in the video so roll tape it's the god thing hey stop the violence hey look at me i can promise you it's a bigger side of life stop the violence you could be a rich nigga you hear me i can promise you i'm talking about i ain't gonna tell you what's in my bank account bitch but hey stop the violence you hear me thank you is it just me or does this come off as a little hypocritical? And first and foremost, let me say, respect the young man, respect his hustle, respect, you know, him as an individual, right? Done a lot, you know, uh, made a lot of money and all that good stuff. One of the top artists and he's young. So you got to give him an opportunity to make his mistakes and grow. I get all that. And, and, and I'm, I'm with that, you know, so it's no hate or nothing like that. No jealousy, no envy. I love to see him successful, but meanwhile, you telling the kids, you know, because the kids, that's what, listen, the kids, the youngster, to stop the violence, but when they put on 50 of your songs, it's nothing but the promotion and glorification, you know, of violence. That's all it is, and, you know, it comes a point in time where we got to look back and say, okay, it's blood on our hands. I, I, was, I was sitting back and I was thinking, like, all right, you had Diddy, he did the little, uh, the Hennessy test the other day versus his little uh, new Ciroc VS, whatever it's called. Like I guess it's like a cognac or brandy, something like that, dark liquor. And I'm like, I'm just thinking about it. And what popped into my head is like these, a lot of these dudes was drug dealers. Now they liquor dealers, right? And not, not to hate, dude, you get your money where you make your money. But you kind of just, you know, switch one hustle for, for another hustle. And both hustles is killing the people, right? Both hustles now they say and 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 when we look at drugs and alcohol, it's really no they are, they're both deadly at the end of the day, just because the government or the man made it legal, we get behind it and we sell it right, and I understand that it's business is commerce, you do your thing, but don't sit up here and act like you know these people are some philanthropists and they really mean well for the people now they're getting checks to promote agendas. They're getting, you know, they're promoting liquor that's killing us wholesale. And at the end of the day, I'm not, you know, and why it's so important in particular for our community is because we influenced by some of these jokers. The children and some of the young adults are influenced by these jokers, man. They already did the studies and the polls and said, oh, you know, if a celebrity says do it or an actor or a sports person says do it, a lot of us are going to move. That's our influences in the community. It's sad, but that's just the way it is. You know, the kids want to be NBA young boy. The kids want to wear the Kyrie's, and you know, that's just what it is. That's just what it is. So I just feel like, you know, in this particular situation, man, it's like you saying what you speaking with a forked tongue. You saying, "Oh, stop the violence!" Oh, now you made it. You rich. Now we'll stop the violence while you on a bracelet and all that. You're looking at prison time, but you got all these kids thinking that violence is cool. That violence is the way to go. So my thing is, it's cool to start saying it, but show it now. Let, let, let's let evolve, and he's young, so it's going to take him time. Evolve as a young man to the next level, right? And let's evolve because the message, your message is important. And when you put music on it, it becomes that more important. Like he could say something, 
and people won't move. But put it on a song or everybody going to do it. Let's, let's get a Stop the Violence song or songs. Let, let, let's get something, you know what I mean? That's all I'm saying, man. I, you know, I hate that you know, somebody got to say this. Somebody has to put this message out there. I know, you know, people are going to take this a whole, a lot of different ways, you know. But it has to be said. This is a conversation that I would have behind, you know, the scenes with somebody like him. Like, you know, you, you're, you're a leader. You're doing a lot. But are you leading people to the slaughter? Or are you leading them to the pasture? It's, it's you know, you have to be held accountable. We all have to be held accountable, you know, for, where, for you know, your influence. You know, you can't just sweep that under the rug. So I want everybody to take time to listen to what I said. I'm open to feedback in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. I really do appreciate you guys listening in to what I had to say this evening. Leave me some comment. Leave me some feedback. Leave me some feedback. Let me know what you guys think, man. Um, follow us on Twitter too. The Twitter is hhu for life. That's hhu for life is the Twitter handle, and um, the website. Our website is hiphopun.com. Here with the hiphop letter un. dot com. And don't worry, because if you go into the description box, everything I just said is in the description box lined up for you you can follow us on all our social media sites twitter and you can check out the website in the description peace